Changing the RGB on the Ajaz AK820 Pro is oddly satisfying, especially if you stare at your keyboard way too long looking for inspiration or, honestly, a break from your spreadsheet. If you're stuck with the default rainbow, I get it. There's a better way. Most folks dive in without the manual, rapidly hammering FN keys, hoping the lights will morph. Spoiler, they usually don't. The Keeb is finicky about input, so knowing exactly what key combos work is worth its weight in gold. For the Ajaz AK820 Pro, the main thing is the magic N key. This little guy is your RGB control hub. Holding it with the right key gives you about a dozen lighting modes, way more than the three most people accidentally cycle through. Step one, press FN plus the right arrow. This cycles through the different RGB presets. You'll see everything from breathing effects to wave, ripple, raindrop, and some mode that honestly looks like Windows 95 screensaver energy. If you want to fine tune the colors, FN plus the left arrow is how you'll switch between monochrome color options in the currently selected mode. Keen eye. Some effects only let you pick colors, others are locked as rainbow. Want to make your keyboard less retina melting at night? FNs up or FNs down adjust the brightness. There are about five levels, not enough to give you eye strain, but enough to create some subtle ambience while you type sad emails. Speed counts too. FN plus the plus plus or minus keys changes how fast the RGB patterns cycle or pulse. Clue, if your rain effect looks like it's lagging, give it some speed. Too frantic? Slow it back down. Pro move for late night gaming. If you crave a static look and want your own custom color, hold FN, tap M, then use FN with arrow keys to select your preferred color. It's basically picking from a preset palette, but with better control than most budget boards. One pain point. If you switch layouts, Mac win, the lighting modes sometimes reset. Every time you swap, double check your RGB setup, or you might think your board forgot what you love. Muscle memory solves everything, but not with RGB. And a real punch in the gut, the AJAWS software, which is not as friendly as it could be. Download it from their website. Hint, Google a JAWS driver, not a JAWS AK820 Pro RGB software, because that yields nothing. Once installed, you can truly customize per-key backlighting. In the software, the per-key RGB is a game changer. Whether you want your WASD keys blinding red or all keys icy blue, just drag and drop colors. You can turn off RGB for certain keys, highlight special bindings, or just flex for no reason. For custom effects, don't sleep on the ability to create macros tied to lighting changes, like make your number pad flash every time you hit enter. If you work in Excel, it's about as exciting as midweek pizza. Before you dive too deep, always save your settings to the keyboard's onboard memory. Otherwise, the AK820 Pro will forget everything the next time you unplug it or restart. You went through all that exquisite tuning, don't lose it to a power outage. And with that, your Ajaz AK820 Pro becomes a beacon of productivity, or distraction, let's be real. Change your colors weekly, make your desk look snazzy, and if you're like me, set something chill so you can pretend you're not working from Portland in the rain again.